actress hip is going to be the Emily Marico, Marico I think, uh, salmon bowl. So I have here salmon, 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 and I already cooked the rice, and I'm gonna cook the salmon. So the lighting in my kitchen is a little bit shitty, but here I have my pan and the salmon that I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna add a little bit of lemon. I'm gonna put in the bowl some rice. To add an ice. Here in the center. And put some um, this paper for baking, baking paper on top and I'm gonna put it in the microwave for 3 minutes I think I'm gonna take this salmon and put it in a bowl to mash it up this is how it looks so my ice almost melted but it's here, you can see it Still, I don't get this ice thing. I'm gonna search it later. But this is how it looks, the rice. So I'm gonna add the salmon into the rice bowl. This is how it looks. Oh my gosh, it, it burns. I'm gonna mix it. So here I have the rice, and now she adds soy sauce first. I'm gonna be adding a little bit. Good, already so good. Oh my god, some sriracha and some cupy mayo. I, I got this only for the video, you know. You gotta do what you gotta do. With a people that adds avocado I have here my avocado I'm gonna try it with avocado as well and then um, I'm gonna have it with this sushi yaki sushi nori I think it's the right one one beta of nori I'm so excited for this one I'm gonna try the kimchi mm, it smells so good I never tried kimchi so I'm gonna do a little taste test. I'm so excited about this one. This is my first time having kimchi. This. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh my gosh, why I didn't know this before? You have to try this Korean kimchi mm, and it's spicy. Now I'm gonna try the salmon with the avocado. So, she doesn't use avocado, but in some TikTok videos, they use avocado. I have hair. How she do it? I'm gonna... Okay, now she takes this paper and does like this. So hard. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna try it with one avocado. One slice. This is so good. I mean, you have to eat this. It is so damn good. I give this with the oh my god dog is just so annoying I just came back to life because I ate and this is what I have left nothing even one grain of rice didn't leave nothing this was so bomb I give this a 10 out of 10 so let's see what what's next hello it's the next day and uh, last night I was not hungry, so that's why I didn't continue like doing trying the the TikTok foods. So the, the next one I'm gonna be trying the tomato and more seen soup. It is a cream, not a soup, made of tomatoes, onions, garlic, cheese, and some delicious like it's very old some things it is autumn it is autumn Did you see that ingredients that we need tomatoes onion garlic cream 
cheese. Oh. Italian herbs. I'm gonna be using some oil first. Olive oil and cover the pan. Okay, so I'm gonna be cutting the tomatoes in this thing. Yes. I think this is good enough. Smaller one just in case it's too much onion, but I love onions. But the other one that I took, oh my god, this is not good. Not good, not good. Okay, so I have here the onion. I'm gonna spread it around. Now it's time for the cheese. I'm gonna be using this whole block of cheese. I think it's going to be enough in the center. Yeah. Italian herbs. Add some chili, some salt, like this one. This is a mix of peppers. I'm gonna use this one. <coughs> For God, he adds a, a little bit of a paprika. I'm gonna be adding some paprika. Now I'm gonna be putting it, this on the oven. Now that I have this ready, I'm gonna mix it with the mixer. In this bowl, I hope it fills everything. I'm just putting everything on this bowl. This is how it looks like. I'm gonna add it in my... This is how it looks like. So let me try this. Okay. Oh my gosh, I love this receipt. I give it a 10 out of 10 again. Oh my gosh, I love everything about this. I mean, this is so soft and creamy. And the bread gives it that crunchy texture. No, no, I'm just laughing about something else. Next, I'm gonna do this um, dumpling, vegetable dumpling receipt that I saw. Not sure if it's very famous because the other ones that I did had like 20 million views. And one thing that I didn't found on the supermarket, I should have buy it from the Asi market, but I forgot. Is the rice paper so I'm going to be making my own rice paper I'll be cooking first the vegetables I have here some zucchini some carrot and then some mushrooms and this is going to be <coughs> my base ingredient I'm not gonna add any meat because I want it to be vegetarian so I can add any meat in the video they add um, tofu but I don't have it for the video. Also, I'm gonna add a little bit of these herbs. To cook this, she uses some white sauce, some sesame oil, and um, I'm gonna add some chili powder because I like it spicy. It's spicy. The garlic. So the filling is ready. This is how it looks like. I'm gonna let it apart and continue the now the rice paper thing. So what I'm gonna need is some rice flour. And in the receipt there is potato straws, but I couldn't find potato straws, so I'm not going to use the with potato straws. You're going to need like the microwave plate and uh, a mixing bowl. In the bowl, I mix it with some water. I'm going to be taking some vegetable paper 
and put it into the microwave plate. And put a, a little bit of this mixture into the rice paper uh, into the plate. So let's see how. And you have to, I mean, I have to spread it around. I'm gonna put two tablespoons. Put it for 45 seconds in the microwave. So let's see how it turns. No! 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 I think that it doesn't work with the vegetable paper because it kind of absorbs the the thing. Let's try. I can see the consistency, but it only sticked in the, into the plate. I came up with an idea Yay! to not throw up this. I'm going to create a rice paste and do a normal dumpling, I, I guess. I'm going to add some flour here. Okay. And then make a big mass of paste. Put the filling in, in there and then steam the dumplings. I think that's a better idea. I think it's good. It's thick and nice and white. I never did this slime. My camera died. I did some, some shapes. They look like a little bit shitty. This is the mass and these are the shapes fitted with the filling that I did earlier. And they are now steaming in the steamer. How I did it, so I take the first one, so, I mean, I take the, the dog, I put the filling inside, and I close the dog. I have to have, add more oil, this is how they look like. But the first ones, they are a little bit sticky, but they don't look that This is how they look. These are my dumplings. I have here some sweet and sour sauce. And I have a mixture of soya, mustard, and the sweet soya that I did myself. So let's try this. I know these are not the rice pepper dumpling rolls, but... I think that the filling is good. Now the next recipe that I'm going to try, I'm sure you saw this on TikTok, it's the cheese. I have here my ingredients. It has mitake, the jalapeno, it's just half, the other half I used it this morning and the cream cheese I think I'm gonna open it a little bit okay, let's fill this I'm taking one sake and just put it in the middle like this I'm gonna cover it with cheese so, taste test. This is how it looks like. So, let me try. Ah, it's spicy. Ah, I loved it. About the dumplings, my camera died. Don't try that at home. I mean, they are not that bad, but not worth the time and effort. Just buy the normal 
like just buy the rice paper and do it. So moving to the next TikTok food. Hello, I'm back. Next day, Hi TikTok guys. food is delicious. I always eat the whole glass. I think. So I bought this from Mercadona. This I I think this is pickled garlic. Mm, smells good. I have to turn the water first. I do this in my room. I'm gonna add some chili powder. Is this too much chili? Ignore this. I'm gonna have it after because I was craving some kind of salmon sushi, so I made this just a little bit. A little bit or a little much. And now I'm gonna add the star of this sriracha. So now I'm closing it. So this is how it looks. I'm not gonna lie, it looks a little bit delicious. So let's give her a try. I'm gonna try one. I'm scared. So spicy. The flavor is so curious. I mean, it's not that bad. Maybe I didn't mix well the ingredients. Some are white, as you can see, and some are very red. I mean, it's good. I don't know why I say it's not that bad because it's good. So she says in the video, she says that she has this in one sitting, the whole jar, and Mine is smaller. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up, a like, and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to follow me on my social media. Bye. Love you.